Well, um, I would say figuring out what we're going to do with uh, digital property rights. Um, you have in current, uh, if we're talking about virtual worlds, in current virtual worlds, users uh, aren't really content just to um, consume what, what major companies, the content they produce. They want to produce themselves. And so you have a conflict in all the worlds I see. Either it, production is not, uh, player content is not allowed, and, or if it is, there's still a lot of legal questions as to who owns that, that content. And I think we're just working that out now. I think that's going to be a biggie. Because if you spend a lot of time in a world making things, investing yourself in it, um, you want some security as, as to ownership. I, mean, I really want kind of a simple thing. I want to be able to have a face-to-face -face conversation um, with, with somebody on the other side of the world that um, captures, that, 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 that's just as good as a face-to-face -face in terms of capturing the nuance of, uh, behavioral nuance of conversation. Um, I'll, know, I know, I'll know it's not a face-to-face. -face. I know I can't reach out and hug them, but it'll be compelling enough that I, uh, that I feel that I'm s uh, sitting across the table from them and, um, and really connecting with them. I do. Um, I see them. I'm worried that people won't leave their houses. I'm worried that people will uh, no longer travel and no longer venture out into the real world because they are so engrossed in the, the, um, the virtual world. And it's not, I wouldn't have thought this 15 years ago, but we're seeing it in other um, aspects of life. You see, you know, children today, uh, they don't, they don't, go out and play outside as much. There, there's a perception that it's more dangerous to be outside. And at the same time, the things that they can do inside in terms of virtual worlds and games uh, are more interesting and compelling. And if that continues, so that the, 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 the physical world gets uh, less appealing and the virtual world gets more appealing, I'll see, you know, I think expect to see people spending all of their waking hours, at least some people. Um, I, well. There's probably a lot. Um, one would be ways that I can um, input my myself into a virtual world. Currently, I use a keyboard, I use a mouse, I might use a gamepad. Um, you know, I want to be freed from all of that and be able to express myself using my body in a natural way without lots of wires and and things like that. So um, I'm imagining, you know. Nano sensors or a variety of technologies where I can just freely um, project myself into a, a virtual world with no, with no wires attached. Ubiquitous computing and uh, smart materials so that the, you know, the very materials that we make our physical world out of are embedded with sensors and actuators and processors. And so we can. You know, we can extract information from. We can make them do things. They can be smart in that we can, you know, program them to know when I'm sitting in a chair, uh, when I've got up, when I've got up from the chair. That you know, the the the, uh, the environment knows where I'm going and what I'm doing. And you know, for better or for worse, it can help me out or it can maybe harm me if it if uh, somebody else is using that uh, data for nefarious purposes. But it's a it goes you know world. We're used, to, we're used to, you know, inanimate objects being smart objects. They, they might just be sitting there, but they are recording, you know, my, uh, they're making a record of my action in that space and my interaction with them. <laughs> one word. Um, that's a tough one. One word. Maybe social. I can't, I can't encompass it all in one word, but a big important part of technologies is that they're enabling people to be uh, social, enabling them to interact with each other in ways that they couldn't before. And to me, that's the exciting part. That is these new, these new um, ways of, of, of making uh, relationships and spending time with people that just weren't possible before.